Hey, hi. Hello again, everybody, and welcome back to the Goat Force Gaming Channel, where we play the roguelikes and the roguelites every single time. Folks, this game needs no introduction at all. I've been waiting for the right moment to dive in, and uh, happy to tell you that moment has come. I'm so excited to show this game off and do a full playthrough of Hades 2 on the channel. Let's dive in. Few tales are told of Hades, whose reign as grim lord of the dead came to a sudden end when all at once his past caught up with him. But gods do not go quietly, and history repeats. So this tale was only a matter of time. This is so exciting to be to Kronos. back in the Hades world. It has been Vengeance for my quite some time. You know, I did mess around with the game just a little bit to kind of see what's what. Looks like we can restore our witch power there at the tree. But I haven't ventured too much further beyond and so we're all going to be seeing this for the first time together if you are also uninitiated like myself I actually tried the game about a month ago or so because I was for a minute getting the Game Informer magazine subscription and of course that was really cool to walk to the mailbox and have a gaming magazine waiting for me there. What a time, right? Remember the days of Nintendo Power? Hey, that was pretty neat. All right, so we can hold down the attack button and kind of slow things down, it seems. And then we also have this projectile capability. And we can throw this circle down, which I believe slows them down. All right. Ah, uh, it's good to be back. Greetings from Olympus and well met there, Sunshine. Look, we can't get to the Titan, but if you truly mean to stop him, then the least I can do is light your way down. Perfect. All right, our first blessing. Your attacks deal more damage in a larger area, plus 40%. Your sprint is faster and inflicts days on surrounding foes. Okay, so apparently we have a sprint as well. If you stand in your casts when they expire, immediately restore witch power. So I think I'm gonna go with the larger area and damage. See if I need this. Okay, yeah, I guess she does sprint. That's cool. All right. So anyway, I was getting Game Informer and they had a full spread on this game and I couldn't resist the urge to jump in oh, so that's what it is we have to hold down on that timer and then the burst pops off that's pretty neat I like how those little hands pop up the art is just beautiful now if we hold this down we get a more powerful bubble-ish projectile. Return to dust. Okay, we've got some kind of resource here. Press I for inventory. Let's see what this is. Ashes, mostly used for unlocking arcana cards. Okay, cool. You know, I remember the first Hades having so many different forms of meta progression from the hub area. Spindles. I'm excited to see what all is going on out here. It looks like we've got the ability to do environmental kills as well. Yep, terrain kill, that's eight. All right, let's get on the right side of this tree. Perfect. Uh, the game has just a wonderful feel to it. I'm going keyboard and mouse, of course. 
And they strongly recommend the controller, you know, they remind you in the menu system. But uh, I have always favored keyboard and mouse for the longest time. And we've been playing a little bit of Gears 5, a buddy and I, on Friday nights. And I will happily tell you that I'm using the controller for that game because it, it just feels wrong to play Gears any other way. Okay. Now, what is that? Can use this at my old tobacco. Psyche, mostly used to raise grasp so that you can activate more arcana cards at once. Okay. Cool. All right, so it looks like we're making a choice between blessings here. This looks interesting. Uh, here's something else that's interesting. All, all of the Hades 2 videos that we're going to do on the channel are going to be rated G. And the reason they're rated G is for giveaway. Yes, folks, we are going to try and give away many copies of this glorious game to all of you. We can do that thanks to the support of everybody on this channel. You know, you watch videos, the channel makes money, and we give that money back to the community in the form of giveaways. And now at last we meet. In the name of Hades, Olympus, I accept this message. So who is this now? You look just like your mother. Oh. I'll not lose her again. I shall freeze hell in its entirety if that is what it takes to get her back. You'll help me, won't you, granddaughter? That's awesome. Goddess of Seasons. Grandmother. Okay, so your specials deal more damage and inflict freeze. So that would be the projectile. Your casts repeatedly deal damage in the area and inflict freeze. That's interesting. That's the circle we throw down. Your sprint forms a cyclone around you that lingers after you stop. I think we're going to do this ice flourish. Life or death. That sounds great. Now, can we charge up at these tables? Or was that just the other table? Apparently, it's just the other table. Uh, I think this is going to give us max HP. And this would probably... Well, you know, hey. We're still getting to know this game. This is literally the first run. Let's try that freeze action, right? Good stuff. So, here's the deal. If you would like to have a chance to win a copy of Hades 2, just leave a comment. That's all you need to do. And on a weekly basis, for as long as this series is going and for as long as we can do this, I'm going to take a look at the comments. Ooh, that is quite helpful. That is quite the boon. Um... So I think we can go to Sharon, or we can go towards the resource. I think we're gonna visit the shop. We've got 82 gold. I don't really know what market prices consist of these days. So let's get a feel for this. So we can buy some fries for 50. I say we go with the power up. Let's do that. Nova strike plus one level. All right. Oh yes, he's always got those deep thoughts. I'm in your debt, Lord Caron. These provisions surely shall make all the difference in my task. What gold I find is yours. Yes. Yes, always giving Lord Caron the the gold, aren't we? Um I feel like we should go this way. Farewell, Lord Caron. Whoa, whoa, let's Get the hell out of there. Slow these dudes down. You know what? I think they're shielded as well. So, the difficulty is heating up. Let me tell you. Gather resources. Cool. Alright, let's, 
blast these guys. All right, that would have been helpful like a minute ago, but uh, but that's okay. Um, all right, I think I'd like to check out what this is. I have a feeling this could be a blessing for us. All right, if you all could just stay in there for just a moment. Perfect. I'm really enjoying her powers so far. You know, being that she is part witch, you get all these interesting magical approaches. Oh, look at this. Doubtless this one knows hatred, not just love. In the name of Hades, Olympus, I accept this message. All right, what do we got here? Why, hello, gorgeous. You look like you can break some hearts even without my aid. Oh, your brother would be so proud, knowing you're fighting for your kin. Okay. Your casts inflict weak and damage foes while dragging them toward the center. You inflict weak on nearby foes and gradually restore magic while any nearby foe is weak. Whenever you use 30 magic, create a heartthrob. Heartthrob is an explosive projectile that revolves around you. Oh, that's interesting, isn't it? Wow. Um, huh. I am thinking... Thinking we go with this because all they have to be is nearby. Yeah, let's do that. Much to learn from her, I think. So all they have to be is right near us. Alright, let's give that a go. And let's uh, continue on, right? Let's see, where are we going here? Oh, okay. I was lost for a second there. Uh, I don't really know what these do yet. I know we've got 10 of those, right? So maybe we, uh, yeah, maybe we go towards the ashes this time. Whoa. Whoa! Whoa! Get away! Alright, I really like this projectile capability. And the fact that as long as there's somebody that's weak next to us, we're going to gradually get our magic back. We can use that a lot more often, which is great. Okay. Um, you know, I'm leaning towards the uh, fruit. You know, I used to know the uh, icons by heart, of course. But it's been a minute. All right, let's do some blasting now. Take advantage of all this extra mana. That was outstanding. A palm of power. Okay, she is. A badass. It's official. Nova Strike. Your attacks deal more damage in a larger area, so that's going to be buffed to 75%. Your specials deal more damage and inflict freeze. Well, we are using that a lot lately, aren't we? I am thinking we go with this. They still grow in the underworld. Okay, I don't know that we're ready for Sharon yet. I, I'm gonna I'm gonna keep calling him Sharon even though it's it's Karen. Um, it is gonna happen from time to time. That looks like an interesting icon, but we've got two nineteen. You know, so we might be able to get some health too. Maybe 
A health and a buff? What do you know about- Ooh, okay. We gotta do it. To be an urgent bit of battlefield relief delivered courtesy of the feared boatman himself. <laughs> Come on, we all have fantasies, gorgeous. Okay. Your casts inflict weak and damage foes while dragging them toward the center. After you enter location, Prime 20 magic to add power to your attack. Prime, a passive reduction to your magic limit until the next location. Now that's interesting. You deal more damage. While you have at least 80% health, the bonus is doubled. Oh, okay. Um, you know, I'm, I'm thinking we double down uh, and add something to the casts since we've got something that helps with our projectile. Let's do that. This feeling, oh. And I'm thinking we go with this too. Okay, Rapture Ring plus one level. Ah, okay. Interesting. All right, let's keep rolling here. Headmistress. There she is. You reached the edge of Erebus already. You have surpassed my expectations, Melenoe. Thank you, Headmistress Hecate, for all your guidance and the compliment. She's so cool looking. In my place, you'd have done the same. Both of them are. However, now is not the time for pleasantries. It is for a demonstration of your capability. Okay. Your capability? You'd have us face each other here, even though my task has already begun. Your training shall never be complete. And I would know if you stand any chance at all against our enemy. Oh, so we've got to fight her. Crossed flames awaken. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Rain hit if we can. Wow, Headmistress Hecate is not messing around out there, folks. You're clearly unprepared as yet. All right. First death. Back already. Who's going to count? Who's going to keep track of the deaths? This old unfinished painting. Don't look away. Don't forget all that the Titan took from you. Now we are going to dig deep in this playthrough. We're gonna see all the things because I I love the lore. Who dares disturb my eternal rest? You trifle with powers far beyond your comprehension, witch. Speak. That was pretty decent. <laughs> that may be pushing it. Okay, if I call you witch like that. She already reminds me of uh, Dusa. Which worked for me in context, and a solid haunting all in all, Dora. But I'd better run. Something I have to do. Then be gone. That's outstanding. Stand tall and show no weakness. All right, we're just gonna check out the surroundings a little bit here. The rivers have flowed back there. See what we can see, right? There you are. Come here. No, I'm still angry at you from last time. Time forced our hand, Melenoi. Nary a soul expected you to slay our enemy last night on a new moon, no less. But you accomplished something of great import. I lack such forgiveness for my failure, had Mistress Hecate. The Titan yet lives, and Olympus yet burns, while I'm back where I started. 
What is it I accomplished? You're here to speak of it. Recovered in body, if not in spirit. You've not failed, merely begun. Thus may you learn, grow stronger, and complete your task. Death to Kronos. It's one of the greatest definitions of a roguelite. Death to Kronos. Fall, get stronger, do it again. That's why we love it. Okay, so I have a talk and a salute option. What does salute do? Be well, headmistress. Oh. And you, Malinoy. That's cool. It's being purified. All right. Hey. Oh. Looks like we've got some NPCs Tell we can. You uh, the bastard. Drove your staff into his wretched skulls with a dagger in his gut. Not that he'd die from that. Works on mortals, though. I've nothing to report, Odysseus. Not yet. Well, you'll get him next time, I reckon. Tough times. Already hit a wall. Knocked your scrawny ass all the way back here. <laughs> it's insane that she's sending you out on foot all on your own. Your skepticism's duly noted. I agree, damn it. How about some support? Right? See some of those progression options. Oh, somebody's tired. We'll find a way to wake you, O oh sleep. I promise. Interesting. Sign of things to come, maybe. My altar. Ooh, use the altar to grow stronger. Okay. All right. I just lent me the arcana. While you channel your magic moves, everything moves slower for two seconds. Okay. Right. Oh, okay. Sorceress. Cool. After you exit a location, restore two health or twice that if you have no more than 30% health. That's interesting. Deal plus 20% damage to foes in your casts. Okay, so we have, if I'm understanding this correctly, we've got three ash, and maybe that's a cost of nine? Maybe, if I'm reading that right? The wayward sun. Okay, maybe I'm not reading that right. I see, so we had nine ash there, hence why we could afford it. Oh, this is cool. All right, so... I am going to go ahead and open that up. Why not? Why not? We use the cast. And what did that open up? Your dash is immediate and your sprint is 5% faster. Cool. All right. Um, That'll do. Well, that's neat. I like that system. The arms of night are now at my disposal. Oh. We shall be soon enough. Some new weapons to look forward to. And it looks like the resources that we need maybe to create those. Much more than just the staff bathing in there. Oh, look at this guy. She has returned. A battle lost. But this is war, young one, and you have many battles yet to come. Shalimus. I bet I said that wrong. I'm not so sure here, so let's see you give me twenty. Oh, okay. Right. So that's going to slow down time now. Yeah, of course we want to keep going. Okay. Forgive me, sir. All right, very cool. What do we got up here? You see? Death to Kronos. I'll see to that. No one is more prepared. Beyond the mists of Erebus, there should be a way down. Too risky heading through Elysium. And too risky to stay. All right. It's time. That's really neat. 
you know, there was a spot in the original Hades where you could kind of gaze out, and uh, I think that's supposed to be an homage to that. Um, all right, so I think this is closed off, Ugh, right? Sealed with wards. wards. Okay. Well, let's give it another uh, shot here, shall we? The Titan. Slay the Titan. See what kind of nasty build we can put together. You're one of my father's brothers, aren't you? Then help him. In the name of Hades, Olympus, I accept this message. <laughs> Niece, you live. Oh, fantastic. You the same fate as your father and your mother and your brother. Oh. Well, how about we turn the tide and exact terrible revenge for poor old Hades and his kin? I love it. Let's do it. Your attacks hit foes with a splash that knocks other foes away. Your special hits foes with a splash. After you strike foes with your weapon, a spirit bubble may appear. A uh, spirit bubble is going to restore magic for us. Uh, you know, I like the sound of some splash damage. All of you gather round. Oh, wow. Okay. That is awesome. And we are now slowing down time slightly when we do that. Held down primary attack. That is tremendous. Okay. Folks, I am really enjoying... Hades 2. What a video game. And you know what's neat? It's a more expensive game. Not everybody here owns this. And uh, we're going to give a bunch of copies away. All thanks to you and the community. You see? Yeah, you know, we'll get to the quarterly uh, update video. Eventually, But what I can say right now is that uh, August was a very strong month. So I, I appreciate everybody's support. And it creates opportunities to do these giveaways. Okay, love the coins. And again, I just I, I want to make sure we don't miss anything. Are there ever coins that drop from these? It doesn't appear so. All right. Um, let's try this one. Let's see. We're getting some health back now. Jeez. Slow down. Those guys are tough. Oh, jeez. I think I've got to get in the habit of using this a little bit more often than I have been. It seems like it is a critical skill. Okay. See, so that raises the max magic. That's great. Yeah, that's a game changer. Okay. Oh yeah. Gotta grab the thing. Um hmm. Mm hmm hmm. Well, I think we're gonna try this, just because I, I don't know what it is. Silken flowers, so soft, divine. Okay. I spin my I can use this and catch whatever comes my way. Oh, jeez. I didn't expect that. There's something in here. Or maybe not. Oh. 
are you doing here? Besides tramping all over my webs, that is. Oh, it's nothing, silly. I can always make more perfectly good silk. I can't always see you. Um, hi, Arachne. Sorry about all this. I think we'll soon be seeing more of one another now. My task has begun. Truly. Why, then, I'll get out of your hair. You have to go. But first, you have to try on one of these. And don't worry about any wear and tear. I've plenty more in stock. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Arachne the Silk Weaver. Um, a special look and bonus that lasts till your armor is depleted from taking damage. Oh, interesting. Okay. Outfit makes you channel 40% faster. Outfit that makes you restore five magic every one second. Wow. Outfit that makes you restore two health whenever you exit a location. So I think right now, that's probably what we need. And it's got a high amount of outfit armor as well. So I'm going to go with that. Do you like it? And oh, we've you. got 159. I think that's enough for something nice. To your success. Okay, Karan, what do you got? Uh, let's go for the the costly one. This one, please. If only you could see my fields in the morning sun, shining brighter than any gold you shall ever find. Such metals ought to remain within the earth. Love it. Your specials deal more damage and inflict freeze. Your sprint forms a cyclone. After you enter a location, prime a barrier that absorbs one instance of damage. Oh, wow. Um, you know what? Let's try this sprint deal. Oh, that's cool. Oh, I think we just pissed him off. All right. The boatman Carol. One time steward of the dead, now skulls the rivers of the underworld in aid of those who yet resist the Titan Lord. What would okay. We do him? Um, let's get more of those. Yeah, this is cool. All right, so those dudes, when they're on their way, when we see them coming, we got to throw down that circle. Got to do it. Ooh, that was a nice room. Okay, so we could go coins, or we could go with a power-up, and I think we'll go with the power-up this time. It's nice getting four health back a time. That thing is so cool. I love those splashes that fly off the attack. It, it's just such a neat power. Okay, wave strike. Level one to level two, so we get five more damage off of those. Yeah, I'm thinking let's do that. Never get enough of those. Press B for boon info. Okay, got it. All right. Um, let's go with this. Ah. You know, I enjoyed the 
gameplay, of course, with the first Hades. You know what I really enjoyed was the storytelling and the world building. How that all came together over time. Mm, man. Okay, let's get something good here. Is up to something, but not even Athena knows what. His assaults on Olympus always fail, even if they've kept us occupied. What's his next move? What do you got for us, Apollo? Your casts inflict days and deal a burst of damage before they expire. Light smite. After you take damage, your foe takes damage and you inflict a daze on all foes. Okay, so we've got uh, a little bit of thorns happening. Your attack has a chance to hit two times. Wow. I really like that. We're going to go with that. Uh, you know, do we go with bones or ash? Um, you know, let's just, let's round it all out, right? Oh, I saw that double attack pop. That is cool. Now let's uh, kick things off that way. Pop that out there. Now if we're not careful here, we're going to end up destroying this armor that's been super helpful in giving us more health back. need bones just not precisely now yeah well I don't necessarily know what those are used for yet this is going to increase our max magic I just don't feel like we've got enough for anything really good at Quran so let's go with the extended magic bar greater focus cool Oh, look at this. We've made it back. Witch. A chill swept through the air as you approach. And seasonably cold. Or perhaps it is as Demeter desires. She aids you, does she not? She does. She knew me for her granddaughter at once. Have you had opportunity to speak with her about me and all that's transpired? No been a bit preoccupied. At least here, Demeter shall be able to cool her wrath against me for keeping you a secret for so long. Well, here we go, folks. The -consuming flame. See if we can do a little bit better this time. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Looking for one of those terrain hits. There goes our armor. This is going to be a tough video game, but I'm loving it. Strong. All right, so let's talk again. upon your bloodline for resummoning me, witch. Hey, everything okay there, Mal? Oh, yes, Dora. It's just I should have gone farther that time. I'll give more notes on your haunting later. All right. Oh, don't beat yourself up. It's fine. We'll get there. We'll get there. 
the cauldron's ready for me oh. now. Last night I dreamt of this. Look at this. Reveal gathering tools within the silver pool. Unlock them to gather more resources. Silver and Psyche. Okay. Dark of chaos, light of moon. Heed now my will. So mote it be. It is done. All right. So do we have that tool now? Oh, that's kind of neat. It shows the uh, dialogue history. Summoning of mercantile fortune. Persuade the wretched broker to appear with whom you may trade bones for various resources. That's cool. I'm ready. By blood and darkness, let my will be done. There. Broker, welcome to the crossroads. <laughs> oh. This guy. Hail, broker. Oh, that's pretty neat. Okay. So you know what? I'm actually gonna buy Trade some you. ashes right now. Ash of the dead. So that we can Be well. open up more of those card slots. What is this over here? The crossroads. That haven hidden twixt the surface and the underworld conceals those still loyal to Lord Hades rightful ruler of the dead all right together we'll retake my father's realm greetings should we see if this guy's got anything new to say uh, the good witch put you to the test out there did she quite an intensive teaching style i always thought she expects a lot from you but that's just what happens when you have such potential then she must be disappointed with my results although she's careful not to show it same as you odysseus Mel beats herself up quite a bit. Oh, I know how dispiriting it is to chart one's course only to lose one's way. We rarely get where we must go the fastest way we can. As long as we get there at all. We will get there. The Altar of Ashes. Okay, what do we got? So while you have less than 100%, your attack and special deal plus 30% damage? Wow. That's pretty cool. Oh, look at this. More max. I mean, that's that's a big jump, too. So this is interesting. Gang, plus two grasp. Greater grasp lets you activate more arcana cards at once. Interesting. Okay. So we definitely want to do this. The Titan. And that opened. Set forth each night with one death defiance. When you fall to zero, automatically restore 40%. Got it. Okay. You have plus 3% chance to dodge. That's cool, too. So it looks like, if I'm understanding this correctly, we can hold up to 10 right now and these two cost two apiece, so that puts us at a total of six. But then if we upgrade this, we can utilize more cards. And who knows, maybe we get more cards created along the way as well. And we can maybe create our own deck of cards. I don't know. We're going to have to find out. Prepared. Folks, this was fun. Um, I'm going to be jumping in and uh, posting these videos throughout the weeks ahead. And like I say, uh, if you want to get in on the chance to win a copy of Hades 2, uh, we're going to be doing weekly giveaways. Now, what's going to be different is I'm going to look at commenters along all the videos uh, that hit during a week, and I'll pick one of you uh, to win a copy of the game. So thanks so much to all of you again for putting our community in a position to do something like this. Uh, I hope to give away a bunch of copies. And um, we can all do that thanks to you. So thanks again for the support. 
Uh, let's do this again sometime soon. We'll get together. We'll play a roguelike or a roguelite because, well, because that's what we do every time here because they're the best. And uh, you're the best. Thanks again for the support. And uh, we'll see you again next time. You take care out there.